Hello all. We are now watching uh, Prospect, which is a movie that came out in 2018. It has uh, Pedro Pascal. Mm -hmm. And that's all I know about it. That's the pre-discussion we have. How dramatic. The movie was suggested to us on uh, Patreon. And uh, yeah, we're going to now react to it. Hope you guys enjoy our reaction. <laughs> Fine. Okay. okay. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> Thanks, movie. There's a lot, a lot of, of confusion. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay. Another logo. Are those old <laughs> headphones or something? <laughs> that was kind of steampunkish. Yeah. Oh, she's in space. Oh. Okay. Those are some interesting looking headphones, then. Yeah. Unless they're going for a steampunk vibe. That's cool. Interesting CG. What kind of movie? Is this a horror film? I don't know. I don't know at all. I don't know either. I don't know all what I know to it was like the sci fi and had yeah. Pedro. And that's, that's, that's all we know. I couldn't sleep. I don't get help. The room looks very lived in. Mm, like, it doesn't that's... look shiny and new, or you see in other sci fi stuff. You have a good point. Clean it, yeah. please. Scrub the... Is that Pedro? No, no, it's okay. not. It's Good. not. Because I thought my, my eyes were just bad. <laughs> Didn't tell me that we could be stranded. We won't. The optimism in that man. We have three cycles for this job. All the noises in the well. background are kind of yeah. eerie. Three cycles back. So I guess it's the amount of time they, they have, have to make to... something to get back. Yeah. Interesting sound design. Yeah, look at the headphones. They look like something out of a steampunk era. It looks like a very old pair of headphones. Yeah. Tell me what. Tell her what? <laughs> Hope we find We're out. We're dying for this information! <laughs> Hope we find out soon. <laughs> Music's nice. That Earth? I think it might be. Are these two are the it's only a green two? Moon, though. Oh, I see. Some little... Might be other planets. It's giving me Expanse vibes. The way where it feels kind of lived in. Reading a manual how to... How to... <laughs> create plan. Oh. Three sides. Oh. Three. Wow, that's cool tech. That's so cool, yeah. It's giving me alien vibes. The, yeah, like, me tech too. With the uh, the way the stations are set, even the room is like and round the color white. Too. Yeah. That's why I keep thinking something horrible is about to happen. Alien related. <laughs> that must be like a homemade of Star Wars. The way the screens are set oh, up. Oh yeah. This is nice. Oh nice. Yeah. Shot. Really nice CG. Yeah. And we got the reflections. Oh yeah. Of the uh, the ship. Mm -hmm. So they have to do that while having CG. That's atmosphere. That's not terrifying at all. If you're in like a little metal box, and it's your death. Oh, well, they're in the atmosphere. That was fast. Oh. The director really liked his tech. Or yeah. created this. Well, of course. <laughs> no kidding. Oh my god, imagine plotting where you're. Now on Earth, I guess. Unless this has become Earth. This has become Earth. <laughs> The dialogue seems pretty light so far. Where they're mm -hmm. not really saying any longer. In a way. Oh, and if if they are father, uh, they are father and daughter, they would know each other's like yeah, yeah, yeah. way ways and, and whatnot. So. They're in Florida. <laughs> <laughs> I don't actually know where they filmed this. I'm just guessing. Oh yeah, they're on one of the alien planets in Stargate. I've seen that in so long. 
which means Canada. What? Why else would they be showing this camera angle? Is there not salvage in that? Or whatever they're doing? She's hmm. probably wondering what happened to the guy. They really made a lot of tech for this. Yeah, they did. What was he doing? Alien creature there? Okay. Squishy ball. You know what I cut it? We're cutting like a baby. A cord, yeah, 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 I was about to say. Okay. I guess they loot alien shit. A treasure hunt by going deeper and deeper and deeper and see what's inside. <laughs> yeah, he's cutting it deeper. Oh, yeah. The blister is punctured. If the phaser touches meat, the whole dig blows. Be more careful. That's probably important. Okay, the music's getting more dramatic, so this is important. If we head back now, there'd be enough time to make sure that we don't miss a swing back. She's concerned about that. So they refill it from alien waters? I assume the water is filtered. Yeah, I was about to say. This is the yeah. future. But... Sure, Mike, stay in. I'll meet you back on three when I get the chance. Two men approaching. There's other people doing there. I caught word of the fade. This is interesting. Oh, this one last quick job. Not a cute. Holy cannon. We know who that is. <laughs> Going through other things. You run into anyone with fluid in motion. I don't have anything. I just arrived. All right, damn it. You don't understand, understand what now. <laughs> There's three of them? Where is it? Oh, perhaps the ship is a tick too rich for you to drop. Go on. I'm not here to prospect. I'm here to harvest. Be careful you don't overplay this technique. That's some interesting dialogue. Location. They're here on some kind of prisoner escort. Found the Queen's Lair on accident. Now they're camped out on the site. We needed a digger. So I'm on contract to harvest it for a cut. Couldn't we just take it all for ourselves? <laughs> nice counter offer. Yeah. No, he's, he's... But I can lead you there. But when he just turn him on to the mercs? Will the mercs turn on him? Okay. I'd like to believe you. Okay. It's so exciting. <laughs> well, he might check his bags and be like, hmm, where's the other half of your stuff? You're... There's a lot of lingo in there that you don't really understand. Yeah. They don't even explain to the audience. <laughs> yeah, just like rolling along with it. Yeah. <laughs> Seen a big guy, right? Yeah. Big guys have said anything. Jesus. It's kind of creepy. Yeah. She should be a little closer so she's more accurate. I agree. Oh, this this Damon dude is is daring. Yeah. He's clearly desperate, I guess, to pay off the debt. Or... Oh yeah, true. And the other guy's just looking at the little girl. He's not even doing anything. We could have been rich together. He's gonna rush him, or...? Yep. <laughs> he was leaning on the other side of his helmet. Yeah, he always... Well, he needs a kid. Because she probably knows where the, uh... The pod? Yeah. Yeah. Where the pod is. Or the Queen's Lair. Well, no wonder they never show this guy's face. They can just get anybody from the staff to do <laughs> this job. <laughs> All you do is just grunt. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, at that point, you're like, now what? Yeah, now what? <laughs> My buddy's dead. Well, he's alive. So you're just gonna put him out of his misery? Oh my god. Oh, jeez. 
Rest in peace, dead. Yeah. He could have shot her. He had the gun at her and he just That's let her true. run away. That's true, yeah. I really like the love and craft put into the ships. Yeah, like, they look too. like actual, like, used stuff. Mm. I like yeah, that about the, Alien and Expanse. Even the chair is broken. Yeah. Like, it's got a rip there. Shiny sci fi is cool, but sometimes you use stuff. Like, I like buttons and tactile feel rather yeah. than these whole hologram shit. Very authentic. Yeah. It gives it a more uh, timeless feel. Yeah, true. She's gonna find out she can't launch it? This. It seems like she and her father weren't very close, though. I don't know what language that is. Mm. Vietnamese? <laughs> okay. Oh, she has to reload it? She should have done that a little earlier. <laughs> oh. She really, she actually shot Literally him. Literally shot him. Good for her, in a way. <laughs> you gotta feel, kid. You killed my father. That is technically true. <laughs> okay, at least he's being truthful. The most she's spoken. I suggest you take it because I will kill you otherwise and don't think that I won't. I believe her. <laughs> Whatever that was, it melted his arm. Jeez, the hole there. Why do Sabrina's actress? Yeah, she does look like her. Stole that Arlac then. No, I don't. <laughs> Together we ravaged the queen. He pretends to be the dad. Do you that? You're trying to trick contribution to his passing. The way he's talking is so weird. <laughs> For everyone else. Entire harvest. Oh, this is interesting. Yeah, I know. Oh, she's just giving him his gun. Because he's, mm. He didn't kill her or try to kill her last time. Well, you kind of killed the only lead on that, so. <laughs> to what he didn't know. That practice keeping you in the dark, if you ask me. Oi, number three. <laughs> Number three. <laughs> so my guess is they're gonna run to something that causes him to defend her with mm. a gun or something. Interesting. No wonder they got him for the actor for Last of Us, right? Is he playing in the upcoming? Oh yeah, he is. He's playing Joel. <laughs> they watched this film and they're like, he's perfect. <laughs> I guess the question is, was he being truthful with Damon? You know, like one third. <sighs> what? I wasn't that. There's a humanoid figure. Thunder. Medical supplies. We don't have time. We don't have a choice. You don't. <laughs> Man, those guns have more kick than they look. Yeah. I sustained a wound that due to inadequate treatment. No, this is pink. You're not a quick treatment. I was hoping. Is that acceptable to you and your colleagues? All right. Here. <laughs> All right. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Just talking in there. Can't imagine having lived in these tents all day. It looks like it's just a circle of a of her house. Of an instrument. Oh yeah. Okay, they just happen to have those on hand. Oh. That's nice. That is nice. Here is our offer. Uh... Put a go. <gasps> that is a bold offer. But he needs her for the... <laughs> what did she do? I, I have no idea what she did. Got distracted by that. And the yelling, I feel like uh, she was doing something. Ursa was probably fighting them or something. Yeah, it in the could back. be. That's what happened. He has no choice now because they probably won't give him the juice, so he's yeah. forced to uh, react. Yeah. Kill the whole family. 
<laughs> Jeez. I really like the sound design in this movie. Yeah, sound design's great. Yeah. Is that number two? <laughs> Oh, or filter. Uh, Maybe. Nice shot. Yeah. Oh, jeez. What? The future chocolate is all everyone eats. <laughs> because it's the chocolate future. Chocolate is timeless. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so did he get treated? Or is he fucked? It doesn't seem like he improved at all, huh? No, if I don't lose my arm. It'll kill me. <laughs> and I can't perform the procedure by myself. Two for flesh, four for bone. Oh. Wait, he's just gonna cop his arm? You got it? I don't think so. Wait, <laughs> is she really gonna do that? I can't watch this. This. <laughs> before. Kinda nice. Tingly. Does it hurt? No, I don't know. Keep going. <laughs> You're doing great. She's so casual about it. Look at that. Ready to help. No job she too seems great. to be pretty calm about coming yeah, up here. She's so casual. That's why she does this every day. Oh, sorry. That's Injection that he gave himself to. He did great acting much. there. Actually. Yeah. With, uh... Oh, no arm. Okay. I guess you were right. Wow. I wonder if he hates her for that though, because she was the one who did this. Then again, call he even. killed yeah, Arm for the father. Yeah, call it even. Just feels the same. You've done this before. Oh, that was a handful. I'm so sorry. <laughs> I'm gonna keep you at arm's length from these jokes. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> This is the most animated I've seen her. Yeah, opening up to him. My name is C. Well, he's gonna show up without an arm, and they're gonna be like, You're the prospector? Oh, there's the mercenaries. I feel like these type of people were gonna kill him. Yes. Yeah, like, why would look they? Look at that. <laughs> they look kind of bored. Bored soldiers is always a bad idea. Prisoner? No, this is where the Mad Max guy Yeah, I was about with. to say, Mad Max. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's kind of smart, actually. Yeah, and talking to each other yeah. while Mrs. Loud. Loud. This is my father. My father. Way off isn't our problem. Hmm. And women. <laughs> Looking down and see why he's doing that. Dun, dun, dun. Mm. This will be fun. Yeah. Guess they just one armed. Yeah. Jeez. Hello. Goes in there, loses his other arm. <laughs> to a bunch of scratch. <laughs> Shall we call it even? <laughs> they really developed all the stuff around this world. Yeah, they did. Problem is, there's a lot of jargon that you don't really understand. They don't explain to the audience. It's a little too much, I think. Fuck num nuggets. It's a little difficult to carve weak handed. So they might just kill him. Yeah, they might her, just yeah, kill him. To see that she's more competent. Oh. That's that works. Not a good idea. What about the lady and the other guy? The rest of the men. Yep. I'm in the fields right there. Now I am going to need assistance if we are fields. <laughs> because what her father said at the beginning of the movie, be careful not to drop that. Yep. <gasps> yep. 
you. Certainly a, uh... Oh. Oh. Okay. They that missed, was easy. Like... Oh, there's more. The guns look like they're made out of plastic. Hi. It's funny how they're working together now. <laughs> Oh, she's going after him. You need to go. You grab the gun and you go. What about the guy in the box? Oh, he got out of the box? Oh, that's the one armed man. Oh, yeah. Wait. Oh. Oh, she's gonna go treat him? I was at a box, but now I'm out. There's no information on what happened to me and what I did. Oh, this guy's been through a lot. <laughs> yeah, losing his arm and now his chest getting fucked. The Mad Max dude. The CG in this is really good. Yeah, it is. Like, it's very unique looking. So they made it back. And he got out alive. Wow. Okay. okay, that's it. That's the end of the movie. Um. Alright. That was a pretty straightforward and quiet, kind of quiet and slow film. But very engaging still. I guess we'll never know what happened to the, uh, the pink man. <laughs> the pink man. <laughs> yeah, there's a little too much, uh, like, jargon, I feel like, to follow. Some stuff has to be kept simpler. Like, you get the gist, right? You know, there's the green planet. Uh, they have to get these Arlax stuff out so they can, um, get rich. The film feels a little incomplete, I guess, is what I'm trying to say. Pretty good, though. Performance by uh, Pedro uh, Pascal was really good, especially. Yeah, I really yeah. enjoyed it. His dialogue was really. I feel like strange, but it was, I I really enjoyed it. Fall. I really enjoyed his dialogue. I feel like maybe that's on purpose, is because the, the way, way he the was raised, wherever he grew up. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah. A different uh, different environment, of course. Yeah. The production was wonderful. Like all the sets and the. Uh, all the little stuff they had, the medical stuff, the ships that were designed, they felt lived in. The equipment they wore really felt like it wasn't, oh, cool, they can jump around yeah. and be badass. It just felt like like life-saving stuff they had to wear. They essentially had to wear. And mm -hmm. all the stuff that had to be charged, filters, they had to think about everything. And you saw how the uh, woman Merc was, like, jamming their transmissions just by music, which was really a neat idea. So they had to talk without the That's, radio. That was very yeah. interesting. Very grounded film. Mm-hmm. I think that it was leaning more towards realism. Like you said, everything was very lived in. The the seats were all ripped. Hey. Yeah, stuff like used and old. Yeah. And uh, yeah, whoever made the the sets for these really enjoyed themselves. I could tell. They did a great job working on the props and everything. They looked mm -hmm. great. Yeah. Even the guns felt kind of cool. Like they had to be charged just to shoot, and then. Had limited ammo. It wasn't the lasers of Star Wars or lightsabers. It but was just it was still, a, still deadly. Yeah. Yeah. It was just a simple prospect where they go get treasure Possible. to get out. <laughs> I see what you did there. <laughs> <laughs> and she went from like you killed my father to I'll save you now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. They still got out on time. So yeah. I guess she figured she had time to save him. Mm. Nice of the pink man to step up. Yeah. We have no idea who he is. Good for him. If it weren't for him, I think she would would have been killed then. Yeah. Yeah, for sure. That guy's aiming was terrible. The worst, worse than a stormtrooper. To be like, fair, literally he, only running one, at him. he only had one arm. Yeah, yeah, that's true. <laughs> he was shooting with his, like, probably non-dominant arm. <laughs> Alright, so if you're reaching your arm into an alien monster, use the arm that's not your dominant arm. <laughs> Exactly. <laughs> For sure. So, in my case, I'll just use my left arm to grab whatever's <laughs> in there. <laughs> and I like how they mentioned the uh, explosive thing, and they bring it back later on in the film. That's how they use it to get away. Yeah. 
yeah, the uh, the fact that he mentioned that, and mm-hmm. then, but there's a reason why he mentioned it, obviously, for the film later to pay off. Oh yeah. It does feel a little uh, I incomplete, wish, though. I wish we had gotten to see more of the like their adventures and more encounters yeah, with different like, species and not just humans. That would have been really cool. Yeah, it felt like it was missing ten more minutes of those two should have been. Yeah, yeah. Trying if, to bond yeah. over something else rather than straight to the merc suddenly. Yeah. So it, it feels a little too short that they suddenly got connected by doing that. Mm. So. Yeah. I don't. I would have loved to see them like see some sort of alien and then they figuring out a way to escape i, I mean I, I know it sounds very, very hollywoodish but it's still i do find it movie. kind of funny they yeah. escape the uh the classic cliche you know like oh the daughter's gonna step up and solve it you know solve the mining yeah, crisis yeah, but no they true. she fucked it up too i thought that was really, i thought, I thought, that was I thought funny. she was gonna do something there too no, and he's like, oh, you two are useless. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's both of you, okay. <laughs> I mean, obviously they wanted that stuff out. That's why he was hoping the daughter could do it. He's like standing there, like, come on, get this shit out. Oh, you can't, you two can't dig worth shit. <laughs> exactly, yeah. But she's very calm compared to him. Yeah. I guess it was, even like, at the beginning Even when the, the father got shot, she didn't overreact. She just ran back and then. Oh, didn't the father say he had something to tell her? Yeah. I never did. Oof. Oof, indeed. But I feel like the first couple of minutes between her and her father was to show that they aren't very close. Yeah, the dialogue with them was kind of, like, short and just straight to the point. They didn't yeah. say anything about the world. They just said stuff, small stuff like, okay, we're leaving Doc. You have to be with the sling loader, stuff and, like that. And he didn't, like, confide in her in a lot of things. Yeah. But overall, I, I really enjoyed that film. I wish it was, like... Slightly longer, or there was like more going on. It does like feel a bit mentioned. like an independent film, more than yeah. a Hollywood film. This feels like Kinda. a concept that was written out as a film, Maybe. but it still follows the same stereotype, and that stereotype cliche, I guess. Where it, uh... well, not really cliche, but the trope, I guess. You can see where this is going. Those two would work together. I thought she would kill just... him at the end, though. Oh, <laughs> I feel like they didn't build up enough for those two, but yeah. Yeah, that's Actually, why. I'm curious. I... Let's see the criticism from the movie, then we can discuss that. Oh. She proves to be the film's toughest character, according to Wikipedia. She is. She was a really uh, tough character, that's for sure. Yeah, those two are great. Mm-hmm. Um, seems to have kind of mixed reviews, I guess. I, I, I personally enjoyed this film. I just thought that it was lacking some more extra scenes, maybe more of like... I needed 10 more stuff. minutes between those two. Yeah. Then it would be perfect. Yeah, I think. exactly. It would be much better that Because it feels like they got thrown together. Yeah. And then they had a chat about her. I thought he was going to like give her a book, the little stream, the stream, the book they were talking about through yeah. the force. Like, I thought they were going to do something with that, too. But I guess they just wanted to show them Bond. Like I said, yeah. And the film needed a little more to flesh out. But I think yeah. I thought it was really good. Yeah, me good too. Good watch. I don't know why it's 6.3 uh, on IMBD. Actually, I feel like it deserves more. That's why sometimes seven, you can't point tell. Five, some, you can't eight? look at IMBD. Sometimes. Maybe not 8, but like some point, you know. I, I would pick some 7 points. something, yeah. Yeah. The world building in the, in the movie was really uh, interesting. The music was good, too. But, like I said, it needed uh, a little more explanations about some of the stuff. Mm-hmm. They, they just throw away meaningless terms, and you have to, like, keep up with it, or you can't. And, uh... Well, like, take Star Wars. A lot of the stuff was, you could just understand in a second. Granted, we've watched Star Wars a million times, so... <laughs> <laughs> it's hard to compare those two, but yeah. But yeah, the world building was really, really cool. Mm-hmm. Interesting. I wonder what else they made, these two. The directors? Yeah, the directors. Oh, the poster looks very... Oh, you can't even click on the name? Oh, Zeke, so they didn't Earl, do any... and Chris Col- So they're not even famous enough to make more? Wow, that phrasing, man. What, what are you implying? I mean, they're not famous enough to write more on this, I guess. That's oh, they are creating something else. Kind of sad. They they should have been make more stuff. So Prospect is a short. Oh, they made it. No, no, that was in 2014. Oh, so Prospect was a short, and then they made it into a full movie. Maybe they got. Check. Maybe they had really good like reviews for this one. Yeah. Yeah, and then they made it into a full film. Cool. That's pretty cool. Yeah. So they're making a new one called Redemption Man. Oh yeah. Oh, so he did the oh, cinematography. Yeah, the cinematography was really cool. cool. Yeah, like the shots was. of her looking at the station as I was leaving, really well done. They didn't—they just let you leave it to your imagination as I was launching. Yep. No grand dramatic stuff. 
and cool shots of the planets around. Granted, I couldn't figure out where the geography was with the planets because you're like, giant planet here, giant planet here, giant planet here. <laughs> like, I don't know where anything is. <laughs> yeah. Asuka was really good. And yeah, so was he her. was. They were both uh, good. Thatcher, I think. That was oh, her is that her name? Something like Thatcher. Let's look at her name. Sophie, Sophie Thatcher. Yeah, she was good. Ah, yeah, she was. Eight, eight wins? Oh, Ooh. nice. What did they win? Six wins. Best narrative feature. Best actress, yeah. She deserved that. Obviously not for Oscars. These oh, are no, like no, awards no. and festivals. Film quests. For and... those who are wondering. Good for her. Nice. Yeah, surprisingly uh, unique. Yeah. For sure. It's not Very a... grounded, very, very slow, but in a good way. Still very engaging. If you're looking for dramatic, awesome space alien action, this isn't no, a movie. This is this more. <laughs> this is more of a character movie, slow yeah. and. Uh, oh, yeah, but yeah, there's some really cool cinematography, CGI shots. So, mm. yeah. Overall, I guess I. Guess we. Yeah, I recommend it. Yeah, overall, good I, film. Yeah, I thought it was pretty good. Yep. Thanks for our recommend. Yes, thank you for recommending this film. Well, hope you guys enjoyed this reaction to Prospect, and we'll see you guys for the next film, whatever that could be. Uh. We have some films coming up. We have them on our Patreon list. Mm -hmm. And we'll watch those as well when we get the chance. So, thanks for watching. Take care. Peace out. And we'll see you guys next time.